what's up YouTube you checking out this week of flyer and I'm out here with the Emacs baby hawk and as you can see I found some new props that fits this thing now these I believe these are 2035 rotor X props they're quad blades and they fit they fit this thing nice they are actually are just very tight so you can just press these on it takes a lot of pressure to get these pressed on here like this so they're not going anywhere they're definitely not coming off but you don't have to use the screw mounts so technically the screw mounts they don't match up so it's not supposed to fit on here but they actually do fit because they're so tight fitting that they don't come off so I just came out here to show you guys what it flies like with these props and just to give you a heads up it was flying awesome when I was uh, testing it at night it, it seems like it got rid of all the jello um, vib the vibrations and everything everything is gone with it it the punch out was crazy with it and I have a little 350 milliamp hour 2s battery that came with the King Kong Q90 so without further ado let's check this thing out see how it flies see I gotta try to get this balance port um, out of the way here try to get that in between the strap the battery strap here okay we're gonna do a hand launch with this too So let's see. Got it plugged up there. Oh man, I don't really have a I don't have a card inside here inside my monitor to record the footage. So I guess we're gonna just do a line of sight right now for now. And then I'll show you guys some, I'll include some FPV footage of this in this video too, so you guys can see that the jello is gone from it. So let me move the antennas out the way. And let's get this thing in the air. As you can see, it's very quiet too. You hardly even hear this thing. So let's check a punch out. So the punch out is real awesome too. Let's check it again. <laughs> so these are the best props by far for this thing flies really awesome with this setup here I love how quiet it is I'm okay, back to the flight This thing flies awesome with these props. I can't remember where I got these props from though. So I gotta hunt these props down again. <laughs> I think I bought like three sets of them. And I broke a pair on my, these props work nice with everything it seems. I was flying my um, Cortex, R Cortex RC Tiny 90 with these props and it was flying really awesome with it. And uh, another set, I broke them down to two props instead of four and it flies nice like that. And now this. I don't know how long this battery is going to hold up. <laughs> this is the smallest battery I ever flown this with. Usually I fly this with a 700 milliamp hour battery from the MJX X600. Let 
This battery seems to give it nice punch though. Seems to be getting a little weak though. So I do have a 700 milliamp hour battery with me too. So we're gonna check that out too with this setup. And then I'll run back in and find the card so I can show you guys some FPV. So let's bring it in really quick. And let's swap out this battery. Okay, let's check it out with the 700 milliamp hour battery on it. Let's check a punch out. Punch out actually doesn't seem as good as the, the punch out with the 350 milliamp hour battery, but it's very nice though. Whoops! <laughs> and I cut throttle. I, well, I shut the motors real quick so it wouldn't take much damage. And everything's intact. So these props are really nice, durable. Oops, let me fix the antenna there. I think that's enough flying around on acro or whatnot. Let's see if we can do some FTV with it now. As you can see, no more vibrations. Okay, I don't know where this battery is. I didn't install a buzzer yet. <laughs> so let's bring this thing in. Ah! 
So that's it. Quick little demo of the Emacs Baby Hawk with these Rotor X 2035 quad blade props. Thanks for watching.